welcome back. Today's video is about the tasting of this guy. So this is a tea cake we call Lu Yu tea cake because it's made with the Gu Zhu Zisun cultivar in the process that was recorded in Lu Yu's Classics of Tea. The actual tasting video was uh, made a couple of days ago when I first got my uh, Osmo, the broken Osmo replaced. It was my first time test driving that. It was really fun. You might find some uh, focus issues like other people have mentioned. I do have to avoid zooming manually to get that really close. And that's about the focus distance, I think. And you will hear the origi original soundtrack from the Osmo as well as the slow-mo video. I enjoy using this theme a lot, and this little guy will be really helpful in my upcoming tea trip, I believe. And as for the tea, when I was organizing my tea closet, I found these two guys yesterday. So those are also a uh, tea cake. Uh, yeah, they're machine made, so they look a little bit more uniform. Let me just show you maybe some other ones. So compared to these handmade ones, which is slightly ugly in shape. But it tastes really interesting. It was a unique experience that Phil and I had. And so if you're interested in this tea, feel free to check out the link down below and keep on watching. Okay, so this is a what we're calling a Lu Yu tea cake. It's a Guju Zisun processed in the way that Lu Yu recorded. It's a really a really dense tea cake, as you can see in here. So I'm going to try and break it with a using a sort of regular puar technique and try not to spear myself. I don't know what to expect here so I <sighs> might I might change my idea as I go here. It was really... Yeah it's really really hard and I really don't want to jab myself so I'm not gonna I'm gonna hunt around for soft spots because sometimes they're soft yeah there's a soft spot there. So I got the knife in pretty good, and I got oh, a good chunk cool. off. That's pretty cool. decent. That wasn't too hard. So you, sometimes you poke around, you find good spots. That's two and a half. Let's go for five grams. Let's, yeah. Let's go for five grams -ish if we can. Try and keep my fingers out of the way. You know, this might be breakable now by hand. But maybe I'll go in this way. That's a little bit hard. This looks a little bit soft. Nope. Well, here we go. Here we go. Hmm. No, that doesn't work. I'm not applying much pressure here. I'm just sort of trying to find a, this path of least resistance. I've come through. snapped off another piece here yeah that's that's close that's four and a half grams plus this shake here I think we can muster up five grams worth of tea mm -hmm, I think so all right not as bad as I feared especially it was so little okay I'm okay. gonna just try and uh... okay all right so we're just getting ready to brew the Luyu tea cakes this is a green tea processed uh, in a method that's uh, from Tang Dynasty era, so it's actually pressed into cake. It's not really a green tea, actually. It's it's a tea that's outside of our current concepts of tea processing. Looks like this. I've already broken it, which you've probably seen. I'm just gonna. There. I think I'll just move this out of the way. I'm gonna just give this a little smell now too. I'm not expecting much. Hmm. You wanna try that? Yep. Pretty consistent with the dry. Right. A little more to the chocolatey side than the sweet date, but it still has a sweetness. It's really interesting. Stable. It is stable. The under, undertone. 
Mm-hmm. That kind of a yeah, not as stable as a shampoo, but it still has that pour. Mm, just a mini bit. Let's rinse it. Yes. Let me get rid of the water because I want to see the color of the rinse. Okay. Beep beep. Splash down. All right. Oh, this guy. Yeah. Shaking there, so I just wait for you. Don't worry about it. Okay. This is exciting. Full boiled water. Don't need to rinse it. Just a. Don't. Nah. No. How long? Let it sit for a bit. I think a good minute, huh? Yeah, because they wash it while、uh, before they produce it. So I want to see how this. Okay. Right. <clears throat> I was gonna rinse it just out of pure habit to get a little second aroma, but that's fine. Right.、Mm, the green tea flavor came up. Mmm. And look at how that floated up to the top. I'm kind of cheating here. That's a whole chunk there. Can this focus? Probably.、I'll、try it. No, I think it's too close. Maybe or too much for reflection. Just back up a bit. Okay. Well, maybe if I do that. Nah,、uh, I don't know. Anyway, let's let it sit for another minute. I'm a little bit excited to taste this. Let's do it. Okay, that's about a minute, maybe even a little bit longer, because <clears throat> we had a photo op. But that was a really hard tea. A little、mm-hmm. bit of cloudiness, like kind of would expect from a green tea. Let's have a look at that liquor. Yeah, hold that up. Huh? Ah, too much. Oh, too much. Yes. All、yeah. right. Let's try it. This is exciting. This one's cloudy. It's different than regular green tea's cloudy. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It's not the same reason. I think not. More close to dark tea. Yellow tea. Ah. I just had yellow tea this morning. This is surprisingly similar. When did you have yellow tea this morning? In my,、uh, in my uh, travel mug. Oh. In fact, if you want a side by side, it's sitting over there by the door. I forgot to bring it. See if this can focus. Wow, really、oh, interesting. This focus distance is here. Mm-hmm. And it's 4K. You don't have to be so. You can like digitally zoom in pretty hardcore. Ah.、Oh. I think that's a lot of work, though. Yes. Has that chocolatey element too. So weird.、Uh, you're right. This is really similar. Um, let's finish the first infusion and do the second infusion. Maybe a little bit shorter. Separately and shorter. I <clears throat> so let's get rid of this. <clears throat> We hit it pretty hard because it's dense, but maybe it didn't need that. Do I have so much dead skin on my fingers? Oh, sorry. How do you find moving the camera around? Maybe what thirty seconds? Yeah. Cause the touch pad is white. Maybe now. Mm-hmm. The liquor color looks yeah, pretty yeah. good. Just using that as a guide, I would say let's give it a shot. Stay away. Let's clean up our cups.、Mm. I cannot imagine if you put salt and cinnamon and star anise in this. I, I think we should do that sometime. I think、uh. we should do a side by side traditional prep as best we can with a、uh, gongfu prep. 
But I want to try that. Did they boil it all together too? Mm-hmm. Woods. And you eat up the leaves. I think that's why their first step of processing is washing the leaves. Leaves. Mm, probably. I'm going to uh, clean up my palate here a bit. And let's boil this one after. What do you think? Mm-hmm. You know what it smell like now? It's like a cooked bamboo. <laughs> mm. You know the cooked bamboo shoot? Mm -hmm. Definitely uh, the second infusion, I think we dialed it in a little bit better. Mm. I think it's a little bit too light for me. Mm. Let's Thinner. Give it a little bit more. Yeah, it's a little bit too thin. It definitely, it has a little hint of sweetness though, which is nice. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go for number three here. Yep. We'll give it a little longer. So this tea seems really robust. I'm just gonna try to boil it and see how it tastes like since... Oh, steamy! Since in old times, that's how they uh, prepare this tea. So the leaves has been boiled for about just three to five minutes and I'm just gonna stop this. Where should I put this? Here. Just put that off the burner and let it stop bubbling and we will see how this tastes like. I think this is my favorite brew. Mm. This is really good. Oh, 
different. Now it's more dark. More mushroomy. Mushroomy? Ew. Oh. Right? Oh, wow. I can picture this with some sugar, salt, and spices, too. Do you want to put some salt in it? I don't know. I'm a little bit scared. I leave a oh, little... this is really rich. This is how it should be prepared. Right? Is... I think so. It, it, it wasn't coming out. Mm. Even when we did the first hard one, we didn't get it all. But I, br I boiled the tea for like a three, three, five five, three to five minutes. And it's not bitter or anything. No, no, no. Hold it. I'm going to... Hold what? Hold this. I'm going to grab some, a little bit of salt and a little bit of ginger. What else do I have? A spice I have at home. Anise. Uh, anise. If that's an element, that's part and, of it. And uh, numb spice. They would use that? I don't know. They might use clover. I don't have clover. clover. We have clove. clove. I don't have clove. I use it up, I think. We gotta anyway, get some let clove. Anyway, let me put some I think we that. have clove. And give this a mini boil. Mm hmm Okay. Oh, shall I pause or let you go? Just a mini bit, okay? No, Just I'm going to stop it. Hold up. Yeah. So I just tasted the uh, the boiled Lu Yu tea cake, and it was the uh, was the best infusion we had so far. Um, the flavors fully fully came out. It had more of a mushroomy element than in the first tasting. Um, but after three to five minutes of boiling, no bitterness at all. Now I gotta go get that foam. <laughs> So I'm just going to add some spice in the uh, tea and boil it a bit. There's a ginger, um, star anise. Uh, uh, yeah, I put some salt as well and uh, non-spice. Sichuan peppercorn. I call that non-spice. Okay, here we go. That's scary. That's all I have. See the salt all come in? Okay, give it a rinse. Make sure the salt will come in. And... Uh, let it boil. So it has been boiled for about three minutes ish and I can smell the <laughs> I can smell the uh, star anise and uh, all that kind of reminds me of a meat cooking meat rather than tea I'm just gonna stop this and see how this tastes like a little bit scary Do you smell the... Yeah, do you want me to tilt that up a bit for you? Uh, no. It does smell the, good. Right? And the liquor become darker. I guess it makes sense with all those spice. Okay. Some for you. Sorry, it is a little bit scary. The aroma should be pretty wacky. <laughs> Wait, okay, I'm, this is a. Uh, I will watch out for your tea. Oh. It's spilling oh. everywhere. Whoops. So, uh, trying this front view? Yes. So. Ugh. What do you think? It's really bitter now. Very bitter. Needs more sugar. Yeah. Yeah. Super bitter. It's very bitter. And uh, the What's first. That from? 
the tea wasn't bitter at all when we had the straight tea. This is from the. No. Do you want to squeeze in the mini screen? Star anise. Yeah, you gotta lock、Here. your face to the side of the screen, not in the middle at all. Oh. That's why. Here. Now you're in. Oh, now I'm in. There we go. Right. With, with my big head. <laughs> It's、uh, the first head was salt. I feel a little bit salty, and、uh, bitter, and really bitter. Like,、oh. do you think it's the spice? It's the spice for sure. Yee.、Yeah. Anyway, not pleasant. More sugar. Not you... pleasant. Oh, I didn't put sugar. Oh, we need sugar now, desperately. Okay, I might just have some candies. I don't like this、uh, spice version, whatever it is, and.、Uh, All the spice I put were quite、uh, not quite random, but uh, uh, just based on my memory, what they might put, I didn't look it up or something. It's not good. It's not good. Maybe we can check the official recipe and <laughs> try and replicate it. I'm sure they didn't drink this. You think? Well, they didn't drink this. Nobody、mm-hmm. drinks this. That's how Tang Dynasty people drink with the spice and all that jazz. I don't know. Anyway, good try. Not gonna try that again. <laughs> Is this better? Better? I gotta rinse my mouth. Let's have some good tea again. Okay. Okay. Bye. Okay. I gotta go. <laughs>